My name is Dr. Karen Walker, and I have the privilege of serving as the Dean of Student Support Programming at Rockford University, as well as a consultant to the United Way of Rock River Valley. My efforts with the United Way in serving as their literacy consultant is to support their efforts and their work with their partners. I work with their partners to ensure that they are implementing effective literacy practices and they are also simultaneously collecting data that will allow us to monitor our progress towards meeting the bold goal that 75% of students in the Winnebago County area will be reading proficiently by grade three. What we've decided to do is to require that our participants have a specific high impact literacy practice focus. Um, we have focused on interactive read alouds. We have taken a look at making sure that our students have access to print and we're encouraging independent student reading and time with books. Also making sure that we're training parents as the first teachers of their children and we're working with at home caregivers as well as classroom teachers. For me, this has been a eye-opening experience, eye-opening that we have phenomenal community partners who are eager to support this initiative. They care so much about meeting this bold goal that they are recruiting volunteers from their organizations, they're participating in training outside of their regular work hours, they are organizing events on the weekends and in the evenings to ensure that our community members have an opportunity to increase the literacy achievement of our earliest readers. Literacy is synonymous with liberty. If we really want community members to be free to make choices about where they'll live and where they'll work and positive contributions that they could make to society, then we have to also be concerned about their literacy levels and we have to be committed to making sure that we are building their literacy proficiency from as soon as birth. I think that um, we often try to rectify situations and circumstances in our communities later on, but this initiative is focused at the foundational level. So if we can build a firm foundation of strong literacy skills from birth to grade three, then we have the foundation set in place and that I'm more confident that students will then be able to accomplish their goals related to career as well as college participation. One of the areas of great impact is the fact that you have multiple partners who are focused on the same goal or initiative. And I think that if we can all work in the same direction, then with the same intensity and training and commitment to that, not just short term, but long term, that we'll be able to gain more traction in meeting the goal. Literacy is a stimulus for improving communities. Low-level literacy skills have a devastating impact on an individual's opportunity to become a productive citizen and to make positive contributions to society. Reading, writing, listening, speaking, those are basic life skills and foundational blocks upon which all other intellectual learning takes place. Literacy proficiency is critical for our students to be successful later in middle school and high school as well as college. And it's critical to their ability to lead successful lives as adults. Truly, truly, literacy is synonymous with liberty. United, we thrive.